gamma radiation has fundamentally transformed the abomination's physiology, greatly enhancing his cellular structure and adding over 800 pounds of bone marrow and tissue from an unknown source. This drastic alteration has resulted in a massive and formidable body, significantly increasing his physical capabilities. Unlike the Hulk, the Abomination's transformation is permanent and stable. He cannot switch back and forth between his human and superhuman states, meaning he is constantly in his enhanced form. This stability gives him a continuous advantage in terms of strength and durability. The Abomination's inability to revert to his human form distinguishes him from other gamma-irradiated beings, making his condition unique. This unchangeable state underscores the permanence and intensity of his mutation, setting him apart as a singularly powerful and imposing figure. The Abomination, whose real name is Emil Blonsky, is a prominent supervillain in the Marvel Universe. A former KGB agent and spy for the Soviet Union, Blonsky was stationed in Yugoslavia when he became involved in a plot to replicate the experiment that created the Hulk. Using gamma radiation, Blonsky deliberately exposed himself to a greater dose than Bruce Banner had received, transforming into the monstrous abomination. Unlike the Hulk, who retains a semblance of his human form and mind, Blonsky's transformation is permanent, leaving him in a monstrous state with superhuman strength and durability that surpasses even the Hulk's but without the ability to revert to his human form. The Abomination's immense power comes with a significant cost. His mind remains intact, allowing him to retain his intelligence and military training, but his monstrous appearance and inability to change back to human form render him an outcast. This, combined with his envy and hatred towards the Hulk, fuels his antagonistic relationship with Bruce Banner the Abomination becomes one of the Hulk's most formidable foes, often clashing with him in destructive battles that highlight the depths of his resentment and the tragedy of his existence.